Well, thank you for watching this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to open uh, multiple QBO companies under use different user ID or uh, same user ID using Google Chrome browser. So let's get started. So I have, uh, I already have one QBO open. In fact, I have a bunch of QBO companies open already. Here's the second one, and here's the third one, right? First one, second one, totally different company, the third one. So I'm going to show you how to do this. All right, so you're on main uh, uh, Google Chrome browser. All you have to do is uh, upper right corner, you'll see three dot, dot lines, horizontal lines in here, line in here. Just click that one under settings it's under settings right below edit just click settings uh your profile setting could be slightly different but you have to click settings and uh under people you will need to add person in here as you can see here i already have uh, uh three additional uh uh people open in here give you a two give you a three give you a four so I'm going to add another one, and for this one, I'm going to call QBO5. You can give it, you can give it any any name you want. So uh, I'm just going to call this QBO5. Uh, so you can, you know, uh, give any name you want. I'm going to select one avatar from this list and just click Add. So now, you know, the new browser is already open, right? Automatically. And if you go to your desktop, you will see additional uh, browser in here. See right here, QBO5. So I have five different browsers in here. See, QBO2, QBO3, QBO4, QBO5. And if you don't like this name, you can just change it. Doesn't matter, rename it any way you want it, right? Okay, so this one is already open. So I'm gonna click this. So that since this is the first time, you need to remember uh, URL address to log in, uh, QuickBooks, right here, qbo.intude.com, qbo.intude.com, remember that one. All right, so now all you have to do is type your user ID, all right, if you want to remember this for next time, just say remember my user ID. And just save it. As you can see, it's open now, right? Okay. So, and if you want to bookmark this, so that next time you don't have to type this, qbo.intute.com and user ID stuff, just uh, go up, right corner here, the so same place, used to be a three dot line in here and then select bookmark this page bookmark this page done so now open see right here so if i close this let's say i'm just gonna close this or log out i'm gonna log out and see what happens okay so i'm i, I already logged out from here but when you when you open this so all you have to do is now i'm gonna then all you have to do is just click this one see this is already saved right and if you want, if you have different user ID, then you know the the one uh, uh, you originally use, you can type new one and add. So you have a bunch of user ID if you want. But anyway, so I'm going to use the same one. Right here. So you know how easy is that? So I have uh, let's see the first one, second one third one and fourth one see I don't open four 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 different QBO companies using different user ID and uh, if you you know if you are using just uh, same user ID normally you can just switch the company in here uh, no, I don't have on, on that one let us see the other one here maybe I have it on this one switch company right if you have if you're using a uh, same user ID for different companies you can switch it but still you can open just one at a time but this way with uh, 
uh, having a bunch of uh, extra uh, browsers see you can open uh, different companies right anyway uh, thanks for uh, watching this video and you can always visit our website for helpful tips newqbo.com newqbo.com thank you again bye